Hey everyone, I'm Ryan Johnson. I'm Carson Stallnaker. And I'm Christian Lill. And we're going to do a Horse Game 2 commentary, similar to the very first one we did for the first Horse Game. The first one did really well, you guys really seemed to like it, and we had a lot of comments on different social media asking if we're doing a second one, so we thought, why not? It's a good idea. Let's hey, do it. here you go. Okay, and we're also going to be throwing in some behind-the-scenes clips, too. Yeah, see, even Lil's excited. The enthusiasm is really <laughs> what's keeping me going right now. I actually right. wasn't in the first Look time. at this. I throw my ball straight to John, and look, and Chase throws it over John, and John, like, flinches, but it's whatever. John, come on, freaking and we ball. liked We really liked how we did the intro last time, so we kind of mimicked it a little bit. And here you go. Probably the, the favorite two shots like from it. Horse Game 1 put in here is kind of like a dream sequence, you know. And here we go. Start off, off with off the backboard. And uh, Lil, you got to be a part of this one. What did you think about this shot? Uh, it was actually it was a great shot. Um, I've never seen uh, actually Brody do this. You know, it was kind of cool because this was my first time even meeting him because I wasn't a part of the horse game one. Yeah, yeah. so it was really cool. Like a new new friendship yeah. formed this week. Yeah, and uh, this was a very unique shot because I've you never... had to throw it that way, correct? Yes, yes. I can't never... overhand that shot. Oh yeah, no, you had to you had to sidearm sling that and hit it just perfect at the top corner of the backboard. Or else, yeah, that shot really wouldn't have had any chance because, yeah, especially if you threw it overhand, that ball would have died. So you had oh, to yeah. be spot on with that and give it a lot of power because that's not only is that a far shot in general, you have to hit it backward <clears throat> first. So, oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. And what's something that happens here? Right this is awesome. Me and John, like the shot before, orchestrated a little celebration, and you'll see here, boom, we high five on oh, the wow. swish. Swish is, I love how it swished. That was like the first time we actually did it right, too. Yeah. Here we go. Here's a reoccurring theme you'll notice out of the video. Me with lame shots. So here's the first <laughs> one. I like shots that go straight in, but look, backboard, rim, rim, backboard, in, in. It, it, God, it rattles around, so you'll see you'll see more of that to come. If you want disappointing shots, just stay tuned. I got more coming for you. But here... Here's a shot we did in the Bruce Pearl video we did a couple months ago, and you can see here Bruce's shot playing, and it's basically the exact same shot as Chase's here. It's a little cooler when Bruce Pearl shoots the ball for you, but you know, it's whatever. You know, it's it's the same same shot. So now here's a shot, Ryan. This is one of your favorites. How about you talk about this one for us? Okay, I really like this shot because one, it's the very first letter, but it's also not really a letter. It's not it's, the typical letter. If, if you're going by standard horse rules, which is what we do, yes, it is a letter. That is why you got a letter for it. But boom. But you trick shot it. rules, that is a sweet shot. But yes, we, we pulled the shot. whole, we wanted to have kind of a twist in this one. So it's like, hey, you made the shot, wrong goal, doesn't count. So I love it. Yeah, and then and then hey, we're all making fun of Brody. And here what? you have you have yes, what we call it bully Massey. Goal. It's John Massey ah. giving like the ha ha. Kind of sounds like a bully on the playground yeah. when you fall and scrape from your knee. The Simpsons, yeah. Yeah. So yeah. that's funny. Now here's John redeeming himself from that kind of pitiful um, taunt here with an awesome over the backboard shot. This Which is, is really difficult because you have to. It has to be. You have to a shoot it high, is what and yeah, there's like a one-inch margin missing, because if you shoot it one inch too far, you miss the rim. If you shoot it one inch too short, you hit the top of the backboard. Yeah. It has to be perfect. So, Brody props has a, to him. Brody has it a little easy here, because he has... Yeah, you can tell he's got the backspin. Back. There's me looking cool under the goal. Not really. <laughs> and here we go. You can see this is actually Wall State Community College Gym. They were really nice to have us out here. And you can see the women's basketball team out there. They were warming up, so... They got to witness Chase make a shot. They were in there for all of three minutes, so that's why they disappeared for Brody's shot. Maybe I they am, all followed us on Instagram. I am lounging Who knows? like a bum <laughs> on the street. Christian's a little tired, isn't Aww. he? <laughs> hey, that was actually the one good night's sleep we had. We got about 10 hours of sleep that night. The rest, we got about two. Yeah. It's just a frisbee in a bag. So here we go, in a bag. And you might think this looks easy because it's because Brody makes it look easy. Brody makes a lot of things look easy. It's it was, not easy, It was guys. supposed it's to be not. a letter. Like... That shot was supposed to be a letter because he was supposed to throw it the yeah, same way Yeah, initially it was did. like, all right, he's going to hold it underhand and throw it the same way Chase did. It's not going to work. And we're like, why, why waste a letter on a shot that's kind of doable? Let's make it Let's make it work. Yeah, yeah. it really ta it didn't take him that long. So no, nah, it wasn't bad at all. It wasn't regrettable. No, seriously, I dare whoever's watching this video right now to go put a freaking Frisbee in a plastic bag and try to throw it. It's, it's very tough. difficult. It's tough. Brody makes a lot of things look easy. I'm Tour de France. Blown away every time. Look at this. We try to include a little more dialogue in this video because, you know, just really more engaging and kind of more personality. So, got a little bit of funny France. funny banter here and Brody with the the Tour de France shot. And the glide cam in the background. Not That's not from. Yeah, there, there it is. is. The oh, this, shot. okay. Maybe the coolest shot in the video. What a lot of people think. I, I'm honestly not that impressed by it because he made it so quickly. I Usually I'm more impressed by the ones that like, you know, after you try for a bit, you figure out how to do it. But he's like, no, I, I can make it. Yeah, so and this, like, is, this oh, is like 75 okay. yards away, guys. This is no, you know, walk in the park here. And he just, he just flings this, man. So let's go with it. Boom, look at that. Look at the curve on it. Curves twice. And... Nah, yeah, I knew that one. Now that's straight darkness. <laughs> Here we go. This is this is one of the reoccurring things. We always have Brian with the shot clock oh hit for, for a letter. Because, you know, there's no way to throw that ball. 
You can't even throw like a he, football. He actually, far. he actually, because he wanted to throw it as far as he could, you had to put a lot of height on it, and he ended up hitting the ceiling and puncturing the basketball. Now you can hear. Like it just, it's it's really funny. We didn't use it for this clip. Really. It seemed more definite when he hits the shot clock than like a yeah. rafter. But and it was kind of hard to hear it with the music playing and the ball popping. Yeah, which was great song by the way. Love the song for this video. Shimmy Fallon by uh, Scott and Brendo. It's awesome. Brody was like, I got a song for it. I've been saving it for a big video. It's like, well, this is as big as it gets, man. Horse Games, the biggest stage. We we edited Trickshot. this entire video like right after we finished filming. Uh, the very last day, it, which was weird because we were all like dead tired, and we, you know, we'll talk more about that in a bit. But no, it was weird that we still stayed up till 4 a.m. finishing this video. Here's Sports Blast, where we actually give more shout outs to the sponsors of Sports Blast. Yeah. Man, yeah, like Sports Brookwood Blast Medical itself. Center. Yeah, I hope you enjoy Academy the free Sports, Coca Cola. I mean, we're just all over the place here, and this is awesome. I love Brody with the Stone Cold. Like, yeah, I, I guess it went in. You know? Here we go. I'm back with the lame. Oh, it hit the backboard twice oh, and the rim cool. twice. That's pretty cool. Carson, have you ever swished a basketball and do a net before? Probably not on camera. We'll see. We'll <laughs> see how this video progresses. But so far, I'm 0 for 2. But I do love this. That's a great letter. Like, you know, because you can kind of kick a frisbee. That's why we went the drop kick route because you just can't. Here, Ryan, talk about something that's a little different about this shot. Okay, and uh, well, there's two versions of Horse Game 2 floating around because we had a lot of extra footage. So in our version on our channel, you will see this shot is not in it because it is a wall ride shot that Brody does where he does it around this curve. Mm -hmm. um, it's awesome. And it drops into the goal. That's a really cool one. So if you want, check out our version. Oh, go frame by frame here. Watch me do like a salute as it goes in. Oh, yeah. But, um, Not really a salute, but I just kind of like. That's cute. You did man. that on I'm every full show. of adorable <laughs> things. And so is KFC for this whole video. <laughs> so let's move on. Lil, Powerade. Lil, please talk about let's this. I love this. Uh, well, I don't really. I don't really know what was going on there. I kind of uh, just yeah, did it. You kind of you probably blacked out when you had to go that hard, dude. You threw yeah. that ball like with all your might. Like, you were trying the... to make it. So moving on, Lil gets us another letter here. Way to go, bud. No, no, and no we're moving on. No chance. Here we go. This is awesome. All right. As you know, horse in a game of Pop. horse, you only get oh, one try. Good. And typically for our videos, we're not good enough to make it one try. But here, John Massey actually makes it one try. And you can see right here as we play it forward that he says something. And and actually, what I love here is Brody's reaction as well. Yeah, Just go like, back to watch his jaw drop. What? And he looks at John like, wow. Because this was actually first try. John just sunk this one. And John puts his arms out, yells first try, and we edit it out because that's just not what you say at a horse game. <laughs> Everything's supposed to be first try, John Massey. Yeah. <laughs> and here, John Massey is full of awesome things favorite. to say. For this shot, he'd been dying all weekend to say, you think you're oh, fancy, you think huh? You're fancy, so y'all? he finally got his chance to say it here, and he'd... He just been on repeat with the, that little catchphrase. I'm gonna say hey, that, John, I'm gonna be yeah. in frame when he says, "Ooh, you fancy," or is he? Yeah, oh yeah, I'm saying that. Oh, yeah. Fancy. You good? You fancy, yeah. huh? Oh, My favorite. You fancy, huh? Watch out. Maybe wait until after he makes it to like mock him. Oh, it's you fancy, so good. huh? Good guy. You're still you fancy. Great. Oh. And then he got whack-a-mole Brian in the background. They had to hold the net down. Yeah, that a net lot. was not tight enough for anything to bounce off of it that far. So we had two people, our drone pilot and Brian, back there holding it. Which is Lewis. <laughs> yeah, Lewis, our drone pilot, pilot, pulling the net down to make sure that shot works. Kind of funny. <laughs> <laughs> the head pops up. You probably didn't notice that until we pointed out. Here you go. Me. Uh oh, what's going to do? Oh, oh, a clean shot. Am I capable of such beauty? Forward. I guess no. so. Pretty sure that one was fake. Oh, yeah, it probably was. <laughs> Here we go. Brody, this is the first shot we recorded for All Force Game, even though it's you know, the third venue. This is the first thing on camera because earlier that morning, we had an epic fail. We rented a hot air balloon, which is as complicated yeah. as it sounds. Uh, uh, yeah, I was, I was driving to Atlanta the day before, called the balloon guy, and he's like, hey, it's looking really windy tomorrow. So I said, okay. We're like, well, what's a little wind? Like, you know, game on. We can still do it. He's like, I'll try to get a crew together and we'll figure it out. So we show up at 5 a.m. the next morning. And sure enough, the balloon caves in on the side while they're in the air. Yeah. yeah. Brody's first time in a hot air balloon. I do not think he will go in one ever again because the it thing was... went horizontal and like Brody and John are like, ah! <laughs> just like, oh my God, like this thing's going to catch on fire and crash. But we wanted that to be like the thumbnail of the video. Like we had so much 
hope for the hot air balloon it was going to be like the finale shot no it was the grand finale and we had to change that up and like the second we got it set up and we were in the air like wind just came out of nowhere and killed us that that was and that was an issue for the entire weekend we had like 20 mile an hour winds the yeah no you yeah here it's awful and but like if that hot air balloon had been anchored correctly they would have probably ended up in a different state (laughs) because there's there's seriously no way to stop it there's no way so here we go here's me with my long snappy navy finally making my shots look a little bit prettier and here's the wind. Look at the field goal post, the indicators of the flags on the uprights. That's It's as windy as that looks, and that frisbee was not going where Brody wanted it to, and so that shot actually took the longest. That was the longest of horse game, too. I fell asleep filming it. We have a picture of Ryan, which I guess we, we might overlay on here. It's Ryan asleep on the ground, like, <laughs> with the camera on. You should see it. Like, literally, we, we were dog piled up. No, both me and Brody fall thing. down after the shot, because it's not joy it's relief it's i don't ever have to see you do this again that was the worst shot in the entire world yeah and it, it, it was wind wind was the worst no thing. brody would have made that indoors in a heartbeat dude lil skills oh he bounced it around he's you're pretty good at spinning that ball on your finger you're the only guy i know who can do that so well. i don't know maybe i don't even know where i am and oh, here's where Brody says let like it drain i want to make a shirt that says that because that he was going to say like let it rain and I drain. Let it drain. Yeah, or something. something. And then it just kind of all ran together into like a drain. And I think that would make a sweet t-shirt. Comment if you the Trash can snipe shot. Here we go. Wind a factor again. Watch this for be lift and dive and just... Mm, look at that. That's insane. Every single time he threw it, he was dead on, but it would just trash can rise and shot. drop like crazy. No, that's why shooting tank. indoors for this video is huge. Because like, Brody's talented. Oh my and gosh. You can see you indoors. Trash the frisbee goes where he shot. wants it. When you're outdoors, it goes where nature wants it. It's awful. There's a shot from Horse wow. Game 2 that you said, hey, do this one again. Last one I'd pick. This was, I mean, look at that. It's like a, a one, oh. what was it, like eight inches of missing room? Oh, like yeah. that, that's oh, yeah. just a trash can. You can't drop it in a trash can. It has to go in the trash can, like on yeah. the side. You can see here's a reverse angle. We'll play it. Or you can see another angle of it. And it's just, that's a that's a tight window. Yeah. That's hard. So I'm glad that we had that try. I mean, it was perfect for what we wanted to do. That's and I think what John does here is actually equally impressive because he puts this ball in the exact same spot. Boom. And, like, that has another inch or two on it. That ball gets stuck. All right, that's a perfect throw. Here we go. Our drone, our sole drone angle of the video. Brody. This is awesome because it's blind. He can't see anything. He and made that in, like, ten tries, maybe? I'd say ten is a good number. And Lil, the athlete, running down the bleachers to... <laughs> I love the joy. That's just genuine joy. You had to, like, kiss the railing up there. Yeah, Lil, tell us about that shot. No, the same thing about this shot is what you were talking about earlier on that uh, John shot in the the stadium that we did at Wallace State. Yeah. Too little, and it hits the top of the backboard, comes back at you, and too much, it'll go over the rim. It's kind of how it was here. Too little, you'd hit the rail. Yeah, look how barely he had to clear this thing. Like, Um, it has to to almost kiss the, the railing for this shot to work. Yeah, you do it too little just to get it over, and it it'll... See, that barely skimmed the rail for about a foot or something like that. And I can't tell you how many times I hit the rail and it come back at me. And but if you threw it too hard, if, if you threw, threw it, it too hard, then you totally overshoot the, the parking goal. Lot. Yeah, it would go right in the parking lot or in the grass where John is right there with the blue shirt. So you had to be almost like at the peak of its flight, right yeah. at, the, at the railing, yeah. so it would fall straight in. And, crazy. and, and You know what I find funny about this like shot, that. too? And like we're going frame by frame here. People, people out of all the shots in this video, they say that this is no, We have fake. this shot on Vine and Instagram, and we get all these kind of like condolence comments like, sorry, guys, it didn't go in. It's like, oh, no, it <sighs> definitely went in. We'll even zoom it in on here. Like, get it right in the rim there, and we can yeah zoom it later but like it's it's in yeah it's in so it swishes that's that's what a good shot should do so and i'm right underneath it i'm pretty much watching it yeah so moving on here we go river chase and i'm at this church we did not intend on shooting here this was a last so minute freaking tired we were so tired of this one because this is the last thing we filmed for horse game two and we came here on a whim like last second it was open we needed stuff and came in it look at it oh by the way fun fact brody said this is his first so ever awkward. chicken wing trick shot he's ever done i think he did a good job me that's great <laughs> that's <the laughs> like, one, like 10 tries. oh yeah he nailed it i love this too oh brody's winning so cleanly looks like i'm probably about to do the same thing right oh wait you guys knew there's one more left <laughs> in me right rim and then it you know anticlimactically falls in okay this shot there's so many good things about this shot. We're going to have to, like, talk about it. Let's and go! the celebration is just awesome. Basically, 
I play volleyball a lot, so I've been dying to do a volleyball shot. And even though we used the regulation basketball and it busted all the capillaries in my arms and I had bruises, this was definitely worth it because just the flow of it with the camera work and the passes, you could just see it go from person to person. It's just such a smooth-looking shot. And then the celebration at the end is pretty solid. Ryan, did you like this shot? I loved it. I liked filming it, too. It was a fun one to do because uh, the entire time I had my camera on the glide cam, I'd say about 90% of the time. So this was just a good one to... You know, just see it bounce and then go right in. It was very. Oh, I just clean. love the, the rhythm of it. It's just it's and it's teamwork. It's all it's you know four people making this shot work. It's awesome. All right, and Brody here. You thought I had it bad. Ooh, that is bone on plastic, folks. That is not an illusion. You're hearing what you're hearing. So much pain in his face. Oh, and this is this is the last thing that we filmed right after we filmed this. Now, we needed Brody's we, arms all weekend, so it's a good thing this is the last thing we did this on was camera. Monday night, we go back to my house for spaghetti, and then we go film the outro for the video, and then we stay up. And then we edit it till 3 a.m., and Brody's flights at 6 a.m. Yeah. <laughs> I got an hour of sleep, and then I had to drive him to the airport. Oh good times. All right, I broke my hand. Cool. All right. And <laughs> next, okay, we're at Lil, This is your uh, your expertise. Tell us a little bit about Dinner. why you're the one making this shot. What, what happened there? Uh, well, first we had John doing this for a, what, like 30 minutes? Like <laughs> yeah. That. Enough time to order a pizza. That's for sure. Yeah, and this shot was actually made after Brody's, but we put mine first. Yeah. And when you see Brody's after this one, you'll see me sitting over there by Ryan with the green shirt on over there Ooh, and, <laughs> and then they were like well or carson actually you probably told me i think me i that. called in some relief yeah well, I, well, I the, issue, john, john, just the issue that john was having and this was an issue that we like we really wanted to do a full video here a few years ago but the ceilings are so low that's yeah we just didn't that you really enough. like each shot is very difficult because it has to go straight you can't rely throwing on throwing it low it. and that's making a hard, it hard basketball goal it, anyways to make it in so that was the issue so. issue with John. He would throw it short, and it wouldn't hit the ceiling. He would throw it long enough, but it would hit the and ceiling. Lil, Lil's just an expert at jumping off of trampolines and making trick shots. Let's just be honest. I think you've done like at least five of those in your career with yeah, us. He's so. Olympic trampoline video. That's yeah. And then <laughs> backyard trick shots. But look at this one. This is I think. Is this your fifth try or less? This was actually like my third. Or fourth and look at him still bouncing like he's yeah, dude, still in like, trampoline I didn't believe, mode. I didn't there's believe. actually there's a version of that where like uh, one of the rough edits of horse games where he immediately goes and does like a backflip. <laughs> yeah, right into, after the, he does into that. the foam pit. But I just oh, love yeah. him still bouncing on the ground. He's still in trampoline mode. Brody between the legs. I love that touch because like yeah, it's good enough to make it in. And then he, he Wait, Brody, can make this one. Here we go. Direct reference to horse game one. That's it. As you may know, Brody hit this really cool shot with a baseball bat in horse game one. So that's why my little line there says, all right, Brody, let's see if you can do this. So, you know, we gave him a little bit more of a challenging one. And this one has to hit a wall first. So we finally we finally got Brody with the baseball bat. Here we go. I love laser shots. We had to bring the goal up there. That wasn't cool. But the shots are That cool. was frustrating. This is, we actually did some hang time on this. Mine's only like how many seconds or frames? It was like 23 frames off, I think. Maybe 27 frames. No, it was less than that. No, because that's like a full second. Yeah. I forget I forget what the difference is there, but no, that like they were both incredibly fast. And I, I'm just admiring this exit sign right there, you know? I did too. I, there's actually, I was so attached to it that I had to kind of like, you know, meet it. So I actually did uh, smash it with a football and it fell to the ground and we had to... Um, we had to fix it. It wasn't cool. <laughs> it was actually the shot before I said, guys, like, just in all seriousness, I'm going to hit the exit sign. I'm not trying to, but it's going to happen. Two yeah. shots later, boom, nails it. And you're bouncing on a trampoline. I and like I didn't salute, like... man. Dude, love this. Boom. <laughs> 60 frames a second. That was actually the first shot of the night right there. Yeah, it's the first yeah. shot we did, the trampoline place. We, this we is right here, after Wallace State. This was, yeah, Sunday. We came here right after we went to the big you know, arena. Oh, uh, what was the problem with this is we stayed here to about, what, like 4 o'clock in the morning? <laughs> <laughs> What was the problem with this shot? There was something in your way, I feel like. Oh, a light How many times fixture? did you hit that light fixture? Uh, I hit that a good solid four times. And those things, like, they would dim and they would, like, bounce back and oh, forth. And yeah. we'd, like, all hold our breath, like, please don't fall, please don't fall. Yeah, oh, the, we, the dust that would come off of them, too. That was like, well, I mean, See, because with the, the way we had the basketball aligned with the trampoline right here, it was just hard to get it far and long. And not high enough to hit the light. Yeah, <laughs> not high enough to hit the light. So, I mean, this right here was... Uh, tricky area because i would keep on hitting that first one right there yeah, we just scooted a little bit closer so that the light wasn't really an issue yeah. anymore and then you, you yeah. start hitting the backboard almost yeah. every time oh yeah no the, the one good. thing that i loved about airwalk was filming as a cameraman it was great because like right after brody and christian make their shots i jump into the phone pit with them with the camera 
Yeah, just cause. Big kid. <laughs> and then here we go. Switch it. And this is when we used our other our camera that uses 60 frames a second. Looks beautiful. Fluid. Bah, he makes it. Let's take this one outside. This, this is insane. Cause throwing from low to high and making that, and that was a tough goal. That's a metal backboard. Hard to do. So this is one of my favorite letters. Spoiler alert. Here, I, you know, you can't throw a basketball that far. You really thought you were going to make that shot? <laughs> I, ha I had this idea right after Brody made his, because Brody was sick. I, like, he was sick the entire weekend. I don't know how he kept doing everything, yeah. but he was Wait, very sick. So right after he made his yeah. outside uh, oh, so in, in shot, and Carson bro. was going to hey, obviously miss it here, just thought, you know, he went to go sit there. down. I was like, Brody, can you like sit down on top of this thing? <laughs> and all he says is, is it stable? And we're like, <laughs> Uh, yeah, I like kind of put my hand on it, and I was like, I think so. I think you're a little more confident. You're like, yeah, you're good. <laughs> and he lays up there. Thank God it was. Yeah. That would have been really awkward. <laughs> <laughs> I like while I'm throwing, just chops my arm off like a big metal sheet. Like it's very comfortable. I just like come out here. Oh, that's beautiful. But I love I that. Just you know, oh, yeah. you really thought you were gonna make that shot. Great dialogue, and you don't see him until after I, you know, go down to throw my hat, or you know, around that time. Yeah. This is the Skyfall. And this is the Skyfall shot. Uh, this Christian, version. Look at you dialing that in. This version, you don't get to hear it, but in the version that we have on our channel, um, you hear uh, we have a bit more time to work with. And Brody says, And I get the shot to Bond, James Bond. And then at the very end, <laughs> yeah, after he makes it. 007, baby. This is awesome. Presents are sweet. Look at the frisbee in Brody's hands. It goes up and then, oh, it's back on his fingers. I love that. No one ever noticed that before. And here we go. Great. Yeah. This is the presidential suite. This is where like, we, we did a shot Beyonce back in 2012. Stay. This is where all the famous people stay. Yeah, this is kind of a flashback of our shot in 2012, which was much faster than this. Yeah. Look at uh, those fall colors. Though. That is beautiful. Yeah. We, we shot this at a great time of year. It was like mid to late November, like 22nd to 24th. And it was just perfect. It was like kind of cold, but not too cold. <laughs> a little embarrassed about this one. Even for Let's just say Horse Game 2 almost didn't happen because of the shot. Yeah. John... John Let's just say he didn't make it in 19 tries like he did the first time. It's a little bit more. Yeah, and I seriously, I said I'm going to give it about seven minutes. I said I'd give it seven minutes before I called it because the lighting was getting really bad. So <laughs> oh my he God. made it, and then we immediately, it's like, all right, take off your hoodie. We have to film the outro. All right, and then right after we did that, five minutes later, sun went down. Now, we're going to have like a little annotation or link somewhere. We have an entire behind-the-scenes video of just the pie segment alone if you're just dying for more. You can see there's actually the letter E on both the pies to determine who's the winner. A lot of people haven't noticed that. But I didn't notice that before either. Yeah. Yeah. No. So this is actually... And this is unsta like this is unscripted or anything. We just decided whoever wins rock paper scissors, you know, do or die wins. I'm glad they didn't tie, but whoever wins wins horse game. Now, if you watch uh, the behind the scenes, John is actually like, yeah, I went with you know. Yeah, Brody had mentioned a couple days earlier, like, yeah, man, I always go with rock for some reason. So John was like, all right, I'm gonna pick scissors. I actually I highly recommend watching that entire behind the scenes. It's really funny and just seeing how we ended it. Oh, because um, John doesn't just take that one pie. Bro uh, John's holding a blueberry pie, and Brody also pies him with that too. And it is permanently stained your dry. Mm, look at that blast zone. Oof. I love it. So that is Horse Game 2. If you haven't seen the greatest common, wow, the greatest game of Horse 1 commentary, you should also watch that. Uh, we're going to maybe do some more of these, but hope you guys enjoyed it. We enjoyed talking to y'all. Well, y'all take care. Uh, and again, if you want us to do a commentary for another video, we're thinking about uh, for golf trick shots. That was another big one that we did with the Brian Bros. If you want us to do commentary behind the scenes for that, uh, for another video that we've done, we well, maybe really even get to. Bruce Pearl mic'd up, right? And get <laughs> commentary. That's that. not so out of the question. We've gotten lucky before. Anyways, just. Y'all take care. Thank you so much for watching, and please let us know in uh, in the comments below what you want us to do next, and we'll get right on it. So thank y'all so much for all the support and for watching the video, and y'all take care.